Hey there, it's Jim Collins. Thanks for stopping by. A lot of healthcare professionals are getting trouble online these days, particularly with social media and making blunders on social media. So I wanted to put together a little discussion here for you on HIPAA and social media. Now, as healthcare professionals, we wear many, many hats. We go to work, we provide care and services, and then we come home and we're normal people. Well, most of us are. So we are a hybrid. We're both professional and casual. Mix in something like social media, Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and we might make mistakes online that can cause us a world of problems. Now, you know that HIPAA stands for the Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act of 1996, and it's really nothing new, but I'd like to focus on the accountability part of it. Most social media violations breach parts two, no, two parts actually, of HIPAA, the privacy and the security rules. Most of the time, it's true. Healthcare professionals don't even realize that they're violating these rules, but doing so can cost these individuals and their businesses a lot of money and possibly even the loss of one's license. So it just is not worth it. Other healthcare professionals may just make very poor choices online and post inappropriate content. There's a lot of risks. Bad news travels quickly and even faster online. Never post any information on a patient, resident, or a client that you are treating. It's not good. You're crossing very serious ethical boundaries that can carry heavy consequences. Never share information that identifies your clients, residents, or patients by their name, their diagnosis, their identity, or where they live, and never ever post photos or images of your patients. There's a lot more information on this topic, and I write about it on my blog. The article is called HIPAA and Social Media, so follow the link below to read it. Check it out. I think you'll like it. And if you're a licensed healthcare professional and you are looking for some CEUs on HIPAA or other topics, follow that link to some really good CEUs online. I'm Dr. Jim. I'd like to thank you for spending some time with me. Be smart and never post anything that will get you into trouble. Don't drink and then get online and post or react in anger. Sometimes silence is best.